All right, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan battle video. So as you guys probably know, there was a pretty significant data download on Global last night. And in today's video, we're gonna check out all of the assets and files and everything else that was added to the game to give you guys a preview of the upcoming celebration on Global. Now, before we get into it, I do wanna give a big shout out to my boy Proton10MG on Twitter for posting all the assets. Make sure to hit him up with a follow. And with all that said, let's uh, pop down to the bottom here and check it out. Okay, so first things first, we have a Tacoma story asset. And we also have a few story assets for Angel, Golden Frieza and a few Angel Final Form Friezas. Now, these are for a story event, but they also happen to be the card arts for the Dokkan Fest transforming Frieza, right? So this is his SSR form, this is the TUR, and this is the transformed Angel Golden Frieza. And from there, we have a few assets for a new story event where we can farm a free-to-play Golden Frieza and Sorbet. So this is one of the stages. There's another stage. There's the third stage. And this is the Awakening Medal for the Frieza and Sorbet. And I believe this one is the map for the new Dokkan event stage for the transforming Frieza. And there is his Awakening Medal. And what else do we have? Oh, okay, this one. This is pretty interesting because I didn't expect it, but I believe it's a Dokkan Festival ticket for the Frieza banner. It could be for something else. It could be for, I mean, at first I was like, maybe it's for the Step Up banner because that's dropping in like one day from now, right? And even though we haven't had tickets, I believe, for previous Step Up banners, it could be something new for this year. But I believe the release date actually coincides with the release date for the Frieza banner. So this should be for the Frieza banner. It's most likely going to be a paid thing. So free to play players, unfortunately, won't be able to take advantage. But I think it's going to be through the Pilaf's Trove. We're going to be we're going to be able to buy a pack, you know, with the ticket. And it's probably going to be like a big multi of like 20 units or something like that. I mean, we've had stuff like this before, right? For the, I believe, um... Man, what were the banners that had it? Was it the Namek Goku? And also maybe Future Gohan? Or maybe Cooler's banner? I don't know, my memory is really bad, but we've definitely had tickets like this where it's one ticket for like 20 units, right? So um, I think it's gonna be something like that. And of course, if you guys are pay to play players and you're planning to summon on the Frieza banner anyways, these tickets are usually pretty good value, okay? So from there we have, oh, okay, another exciting thing. Babidi and Dabura finally translated, which means that they are going to be released with this upcoming celebration. So we finally have this new, you know, Battlefield LR on Global that I honestly thought we should have gotten like a long time ago because they are pretty, I don't want to say old, but they've been on JP for a long time. So every single time we had a new Battlefield, I was like, okay, this is the one, right? Like we got to get LR Babidi and Dabura now. We gotta get LR Poverty and Tabura now, and just never happened. But now, it's finally here. So with the next Battlefield, which is dropping, uh, I believe on the 4th, January 4th, we will be able to buy this LR with our Battlefield memory. And uh, here are a few of the uh, Super Attack lines for the LR, Bobbity Sinister Sorcery. There's the line, and then the uh, other is Evil Splash. Okay, so there we go. LR, Bobbity and Tabura, finally on global and uh, these are assets for the free to play frieza that token awakens into a golden frieza and sorbet really really solid free to play unit by the way and these are the token awakening assets for the uh tech angel frieza and also the agl uh angel it's agl right i think it's agl agl angel perfect cell so there you go and uh, these are the actual card assets now for the Dokkan Fest Frieza. There's Golden Frieza. There's the SSR Frieza. And there is the TUR Frieza as well. I love this. I love this pose, man. I, he just looks like such a troll, honestly. Like he just looks like he's trolling, which is really awesome to me. Like that's my favorite form of Frieza. You know when he's trolling people. So there you go, guys. Those are all the assets from this data download. A quick breakdown. A quick um, review, I guess. Biz, Angel, Final Form, Frieza, AGL, Angel, Perfect Cell, and Tech, Angel, Final Form, Frieza, Free to Play, Tech, Golden, Frieza, and Sorbet, AGL, LR, Bobbidi, and Tabura Translated, and Dokkan Fest Ticket. And uh, by the way, 
the Frieza banner is going to be dropping on January 4th. That's also when, I guess, the New Year celebration technically starts. So uh, if you guys you know, are planning to summon, then get your stones ready. Obviously, we do have the Step Up banner in between, and that was confirmed on JP with a little preview image with like Gogeta and Janemba with like 2021. So yeah, that is definitely happening on both sides as expected. And uh, that's pretty much it, guys. That is the data download. And uh, before we leave, I want to give you guys the details for Bobbity and Debora, as well as the Golden Frieza and Sorbet, because I never covered those on the channel. If you want the details for the Dokkan Fest Frieza or the Dokkan Awakenings for uh, Cell and Frieza, like the you know non Dokkan Fest ones, then uh, feel free to check out the video that I made yesterday. I'll put a link above my head where I talk about all of those. Okay, so anyways, we're gonna pop over now to the Dokkan Wiki. And we're going to start here with the Battlefield LR Bobbity and Dabura. Their leader skill is Majin Buu Saga, key plus 3, HP attack and defense plus 130%, 12 key super, evil splash, colossal damage, and seals super attack. And the 18 key is Bobbity's sinister sorcery, which causes mega colossal damage with a high chance of stunning the enemy. Passive is key plus 3, attack and defense plus 88%, plus an additional key plus 3, and attack and defense plus 40% when the target enemy is in attack down or defense down status, plus an additional key plus 3, and high chance of performing a critical hit when the target enemy is stunned or the target enemy super attack is sealed. Majin power category allies key plus 3, attack and defense plus 30%. And their links are, mas are Master Magic, Majin, Resurrection Plan, Thirst for Conquest, Brutal Beatdown, Nightmare, Fear and Faith, and Legendary Power. And categories are Majin Buu Saga, Joint Forces, and Terrifying Conquerors. So uh, yeah, that is the LR for you. You can buy it for three. Actually, I don't know if it's going to be the same price. Are all the um, LRs and units you know, in the Battlefield shop the same price on Global and JP? Because I think there might be some discrepancies. Either way, on JP, it's 330000 It could be the same for Global. And uh, yeah, that is a lot. So hopefully you guys have been saving up. If not, it might take you a while to be able to buy them. And that's LR, Bobbity, and Tabora. And now let's pop over to the Golden Frieza and Sorbet. So this is uh, free to play, and this is available through a new story event. Their leader skill is going to be Joint Forces Category Key Plus 2, HP Attack and Defense Plus 50%, or Tech Type Key Plus 2, HP Attack and Defense Plus 30%, Super Attack Supreme Damage with a high chance of stunning the enemy. And passive is attack and defense plus 120% when HP is 50% or more. Key plus 6 performs a critical hit and stuns the attack enemy within the same turn after receiving attack. That's that's pretty crazy. I mean, 120% attack and defense is good, right? But he guarantees stuns. He guarantees stuns and guarantees critical after receiving an attack. And he also reduces damage received by 50% when HP is 49% or less. So that's also pretty freaking awesome. Now, of course, he does uh, lose this attack and defense, but 50% damage reduction is no joke. And still, man, guaranteed stun, guaranteed critical after receiving an attack. So like like I said, awesome free-to-play unit. And links are new Frieza army, Brainiacs, Coward, Old Judgment, Thirds for Conquest, Prodigies, and Shattering the Limit, obviously. Um, not the best links, especially like, you know, this one, <laughs> Coward, is not the best either in terms of like the availability of Link U partners. But overall, still a very good free to play unit, in my opinion. And uh, categories are Joint Forces, Terrifying Conquerors, Final Trump Card, and Battle of Wits. So there you go, guys. Golden Frieza and Sorbet, Bobbity and Tabora, Global Data Download, and uh, that's. All I gotta say, hope you guys are excited for Frieza's release. More so, actually, before that happens. Hope you guys are excited for the Step Up banner. I will be streaming my summons as soon as that drops, so make sure you guys tune in. But uh, that's it, guys. If I don't get to say you know anything to you before the new year happens, before we cross over to 2021, then I wish you guys a happy new year. Hope uh, 2021 is much better for most people than 2020 was, because obviously this year was pretty rough for most people. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. As always, if you liked it, then make sure to like the damn video. And 
If it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.